honesty. Flexible honesty. Yes, and yes, yes. The flexibility of that honest statement was just quite large. So Indeed. I wouldn't go so far as to say it was a lie. That's a very strong word. Spacey's. Spacey's. Takes me back to the day. Yeah, yeah. People um, would demand Fox only, uh, FD, no items. I suppose you don't know the lore. Uh, Sphinx dropped not. Inkling because he's... Oh, because I did hear about that. Yeah, yes. yeah. Now he's, he's a wolf player. I had the pleasure of playing against him on stream last week. Oh, okay. Or I should say I had the misfortune of having to sit within a few feet of this guy. But anyway, <laughs> so we're heading straight to the match. Mr. Mojo Man is a name that I know. And I've been in the scene been around. for UCSD for about four or five years now. So his skill level at the time I knew him, he was a bit on the newer side, but clearly he has exhibited some improvement since then. You know, at face value, it's hard to tell within 30 seconds, of course, but Sphinx, a scary player in his e own indeed. right. Indeed. Yes. Very scary. This so guy's ledge trapping. Oh my gosh. There, there it is. We, we didn't even get to see it, but Sphinx's ledge trapping is insane. Yeah. Like, this guy, you don't want to be off stage against him. It is not a fun place yeah, to be. Yeah, I, I was playing against him with Richter, and, and his ledge trapping was about as as suffocating as mine was. <laughs> so it's just, <laughs> he, he has the character on lock. You know, back when I last played as Wolf in the previous years, it wasn't nearly as polished or as scary as it is now. And Mojo Man can be great. He really can be. But against a player like Sphinx, sometimes it's just hard to tell. <laughs> yeah. It, it's rough. Oh, that was nice, though. Yeah, bear in okay. mind, for anyone who's watching this, Sphinx is a regular placer in the top three. Yeah, Sphinx is... Yeah, I think he's PR number two, I believe, for last quarter. He's on the eSports team. He is, like, one of our best players, so... Yeah, and great cognizance on Mojo Man's part to use the reflector. You know... Oh wow, oh, that wow. was interesting. That was snap, the magnet wasn't it? hands right there. Yeah, my goodness, he had the he had the all the magnets in stock. My man went to Staples. <laughs> yeah, he's he's loaded. Oh my gosh! So that was a very interesting ledge snap, I have to say. But still, and there Sphinx. You go. Oh, that's oh, what's scary. Is that it? Wow! Oh, misses look it. at the angle though. Yeah, that that's was so. That's a tough angle. angle. The preciseness of. Mojo's recoveries. Oh, oh the back but. air. Yep. Wolf back air. Yeah. That, that, like. I don't think much more has to be said. Just wolf back yeah, air. Yeah, wolf back, wolf back air. air. There it is. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> that was it. <laughs> yeah, displaying for us yeah. exactly what happened last. And certainly a very strong first stock or first game by Sphinx. Yeah, just again. What do we want to see out of Mr. Mojo, man? I personally, you know, having a wolf that's, I mean, a fox that's definitely fraudulent, but it's, you know, it's all right. I think that either he's hyper aggressive and I need mean, he needs to dial the aggressiveness that he displayed last game to about three or four times. Constant, you know, constant dash attacks, constant tomahawk grabs. I wanna see a suffocating approach. Uh -huh. Either that or that he needs to play the opposite and just be very defensive. Right now he's not committing entirely one way or the other, and it's making it very easy for Sphinx to see the way he's gonna approach and you know just just grab, just throw, put him in a really bad situation. You know, the way Light or you know ZD will play hyper aggressive. Oh, look at look at this movement right now. Did <laughs> you see those? You see those baits? Oh, jumping man. in like no, just kidding. Okay, oh, Barry. Okay, so this is this is. I'm nice. liking what I'm seeing. This is nice. We're seeing. Oh, oh okay. So okay. I don't think it's, it's a huge huge thing, but you know. We're clearly seeing that he has some game plan in mind. Yeah. You're not you're not weaving in and out and boxing like that and bait and switching unless you have that game plan. But it's those pauses and that indecisiveness and that non-commitment. That's what I, I would like to see emptied out as the game progresses. But look at this. Starting very different than the last yep, one. Yep, it's starting very different, but Oh boy. Oh yeah. But uh, Sphinx got one advantage and he's just Milky snowballed for this worth, for like seventy yeah. percent. All right, not going to get the two frame, but scary. He you hits think that they two both frame weigh the same, or do you think Fox is probably lighter? I would imagine Fox is lighter, but I don't know that's true. I oh oh hey, okay. I like that Mojo. Okay, <laughs> the the absolute galaxy brain move, saying yeah, I'm gonna roll. What are you gonna do about <laughs> it? <laughs> and it just the perfectly timed air dodge and a stall with the shine. Yeah, very different start to this game, and I like that. Now he has a confirmed the jab there. He, I've noticed he's dropped that opportunity several times now. When he lands a falling there oh, like and that, two frame. yeah, 
But when he lands a fall in there like that, especially at low percent, he's an entitled to that jab. Yeah. Every little thing matters in this situation. Not only would that give him damage, but that would have helped him escape from the ledge trap by knocking Sphinx back to center stage. So just all the little things that add up. But look at this. Look at this difference in the game. Yeah. He, he's turned it around this game. 77%. Oh, commentator's curse, perhaps. No, no commentator's no, curse. Oh, yeah. I, I think right now, sure, you know, neutral will, will shift favor over and over again, but at least it's not one side yeah. like it was last game. This is very true. Ooh. Oh, no tech. That is such a scary position. Oh, to be in. that was almost he goes really, for the really roll bad. Card. Yeah. Ooh, to play with fire. That back air takes yeah. away. I'm noticing that Sphinx is going for a lot of uh, just neutral tech reads, trying to get the grab. Hasn't really been finding them. Nice mix up right there. Yeah, I think that's. Oh, again! Okay. Okay. Let's just like listen, Sphinx. All right. You're number two in the club. Well, how about number two in this game? In like, he's, he's just... My man does not care. Sphinx is just another human being, and he's making that known right now. Look at, look at the change between last game, too. Seriously. Last stock. Yep, last, last stock. stock. even. Exciting stuff. Let's see if we can see this to a game three. I'd literally like to see a game three. I would love to see a game Imagine three. Imagine the upset. Dude, you know, Mojo Man going over Sphinx, who is probably the number two seed, I'd have to imagine. I would imagine. Or, or up there, at least. We can, we can, we can check right now. Yeah, Indeed, it's number the number two, two seed. Wow. Uh, don't roll in. Perfect. That was great. Yeah, very cognizant of what Sphinx wants to see out of panic tech options. So both of these characters are lights. I think right now we see a clear lead, but if he closes this gap only a little bit, that up smash, we see what we can do. Yeah. Ooh. Oh. Ooh, nice. Okay. Nice. Oh, trying oh. to go for it again. I think he needs a bit more percent. Oh, it, now it'll do it. Now it'll definitely do it. Oh, I think he had a frame trap right there. I think I he did. Think that he air did. dodge was too... Oh, oh no. Oh, and there's the up tilt. All what right. a close game. That was, that yeah, was a great show. That was showing. some fantastic adaptation from yeah. Mr. Mojo Man. A great showing. Easily the best adaptation I've seen of all the stream sets today. R seriously. You know, it's been about four or five. Yeah. So that's that is that was a great showing. All right. Well, good stuff to Mr. Mojo Man. Absolutely. Honestly. 2-0, but like 2-0 doesn't actually say the whole story. Yeah, it never shows the whole story, does it? Yeah. It really doesn't. Like, you would have to check out